Well, bring me your toy. Bring me your toy, Ziffy. Are you are you not going to bring me your toy? You can't play if you don't bring it to me. Hey, kia ora. Helen Brahms here coming to you live from Sun City in Arizona. Hope you're all having a super fantastic Sparkling Magic Monday. It has been a very magical day here. Lots of stuff going on. Lots of productivity got done today. Um... productivity. She decided she wants to chomp on a treat. Um, so we, um, this morning we talked about, you know, five ways that you can get your mindset into the, into the brand new week with planning over the weekend, your I am statements morning and night, writing down five things um, positive about your day today, writing down five things that you are grateful for and taking act, excuse me, um, as I said, we've had a crazy, busy, productive day today. It has been Full on, all out, um, everything else, and um, it's actually quite cool. It's a lot cooler here in the RV today, only because we still have the awning out. It's seven fifty. It's five fifteen at night, and the awning is still out, which means that the passenger side of the RV is in shade. So we're managing to keep it, and it's um, like a hundred and what is it today? Oh, da 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 da! I totally forgot to look at it today. It's 100 degrees outside today, and it's 85 inside, so everything is working as it should be, which is awesome. Um, because typically the air conditioner, when you have the air conditioners working at their best, they typically get you about 20 degrees cooler than what it is outside. So to go 15 degrees and we're only having one AC, that's not so bad. That's pretty good. And it helps a lot when the awning stays out because it keeps the windows on the passenger side, with the exception of the passenger window itself, it keeps... Um, the other windows in shade as well as the refrigerator in shade too so they're not generating extra heat coming in or anything like that so yay but only three sleeps to go till we get the screens installed and i can't wait i meant to be here between one and three on thursday and uh hopefully they will do the passenger side first um because that will be the sunny although they may start on the shade side i don't know it's up to them where they want to start but anyway um, so it's been a good day. Zephy has like slept most of it. Come out every now and again. She'll play with either her toy or her chew, the chew stick, and she'll only play for like a minute or two. And but the second I have these little snack packs that have um, little cubes of cheese in them and cashews and um, craisins, and um, she knows when I unwrap one of, or when I open one of those, and boom, like that, she was out of the bedroom and sitting up next to me here on the bench like just like, like sniffing and she like put her nose across in front of my face and I look at her and go what are you doing and she'll just sort of like go and look straight ahead like I wasn't really looking at what you were doing mum not really no but anyway so <laughs> crazy I know crazy dog but um yeah she's been good she's been good today um been an excellent walk this morning a good walk this morning she actually listened to me and didn't try to she usually tries to um get to she's eating a lot of grass she loves to go outside when we're walking along and we the, especially the pieces that we get on that where the rain has not the rain the um where they have just finished the um the sprinkler system has just finished on that patch of grass she will get on there and she starts chewing on the grass because it's all nice and wet and tasty so um but yeah now she's jumping on now jumping on your chew toy good girl um so yeah, so she likes to do that, and some days she just stretches the um, the leash as far as she can. Then she gets down low to the ground and tries to stretch it even further. I know, crazy dog, crazy, crazy, crazy dog. <laughs> and I just stand there, and she's like, stretch, 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 stretch. And then she gets low to the ground and tries to stretch just a little bit further to get that patch. Um, tries to get me off balance, so I will take at least a couple of steps, and then she'll be fine. Um, doesn't always work. But today she didn't do any of that with me too today, which was really good. She just was interested in walking, getting out there, getting her stuff done, going for a good walk. Um, and then she was happy to come back and have some breakfast and uh, something to drink in that. And she sat up on the windowsill for a bit and then she went into the bedroom and was basically hung out there all day, but come out every now and again to check up on me. And Although I found her water bowl going down, but I think it's more air, more evaporation because it's so dry here at the moment. Um, so I'm trying to encourage her to drink just a little more water because I get worried that she might get dehydrated. But 
But anyway, so that's been our day. It has been, like I said, a very crazy productive day today. We've got three sleeps to go till we get the screens put in. Yes. <laughs> I am so looking forward to that, to being in a nice, cool RV again. Um, the problem I find is that when it gets warm in the afternoons, is I start getting sleepy. And so this gets drained several times. This is an 18 ounce um, water bottle and um, it gets drained several times in the afternoon um, to just help keep me awake because it's, it's cold because I put, I have um, water in the refrigerator and so I just fill it up from that and I've got two containers in there and I switch them around. Um, so be one container, the next one fill, the second container, the second fill. That way it gives the other container time to cool down and get to temperature but it's not like ice cold water in here um, with this heat and everything else so it's all learning about trying to stay cool the longer you can leave the awning out on your passenger side the better um, especially if your passenger side faces west or south east not so much because it's not there for very long um, but if it faces south or south or west which is mine faces west um, but the wind is usually coming from the southwest today it's been coming from the east and the northeast and the southeast so it's been more over that way <laughs> um, more of that way from the front so um, I haven't had to tuck it away yet and there's no it's not even moving out there or fluttering or anything right now I don't see any trees out there moving so it's nice and still right now which means it's going to be awfully hot when we do go out but it is a cooler day today. It's only 100. <laughs> Not 106 like it has been over the last few days, but it's only 100 today. I think tomorrow's meant to be like 98. So we actually break back into the two digits tomorrow for the day, which is awesome. And I have one sleep left before the um, screens get installed. So, but anyway, that's it from us for today. Have a super fantastic sparkling evening. If you're watching this on YouTube, please click the like um, and the subscribe button. And if you want to get notifications of when we put up new videos, please um, click the little bell. And um, otherwise, have a super fantastic sparkling evening. And we will catch you guys tomorrow for Tune Up Tuesday.